Hi Jurassic, Katie's Wayne here. Today we're going to draw Adrian from Miraculous Ladybug. So let's get started. To draw Adrian, let's start by drawing his face. So and we're going to come right here and draw the bottom of a U. So I'm going to start by right here. And come right across, so about right here. And I'm just gonna, gonna connect it with a curve. There, so bottom of a U. And then let's come to where you started and we're gonna draw his eyes. So I'm gonna come right here towards the edge and just draw a curve. And the same thing on this side. And using that curve, I'm gonna come inside of that curve. Just gonna bring it a little bit more and draw another curve inside of it. And then at the bottom right here, I'm just gonna add a very slight curve. To create the eye. So same thing over here. So it's a curve inside and then at the bottom a slight curve. There. So then let's make them draw so cute eyes. Same thing, just uh, two small circles for highlights and a curve line at the bottom and shade in the top part. and the lines at the bottom. So same thing over here. There. Okay, so now we have the eyes in. Let's um, come to the center about right here. We're gonna give him a smile. So right in the center, uh, right there. Slight smirk and then cap off the ends. And then now let's bring this up a little bit more for his face. And about right there, I'm gonna come above his eye and draw his eyebrows. So it's just a soft curve above each eye. And I'm just going to come in here and thicken it up. And then now let's go ahead and come to the side right here and draw his ears. So where his eyes are, let's come right here on the side and pop out a curve. Come in here some details. Same thing right here. Where his eyes are. Okay, so then now let's draw his hair. Um, I'm going to come right on this side because it kind of has hair parts over here and we're going to start to draw a bunch of zigzags to um, draw his hair. So I'm going to start, let's say about right here. I'll give myself a point and from this point I'm going to draw two strands. We're going to start with two small strands. One, two, and then this side is going to flare out. It's going to come right out. So whatever room you have left, you can come in here and just finish it off. And then we're going to draw a long strand that kind of goes really close to his eyebrow. So let's come right here, right above his brow, zigzag it in and out. And come right back in here, wherever you have enough room, just go ahead and finish his um, face. So then now that we have that in, Let's come right here on the sides and we're going to draw some zigzags again. So we're just going to fill in the space right here for the side and same thing here. It's just some um, curves. And so then let's come about right here. So his hair, we're going to use this curve as where his hair is going to part. It's going to go up so uh, about right here, nice and full. I'm going to use this as my curve to go up and this side is going to come down. So now let's go up. 
and then we're going to start to come down. And as we come down right here, I'm just going to add a strand. And we're going to come down more. And so in this area, I'm going to come about right here and bring out two big zigzags. So one. And we're going to bring it right back in here. Two. And then you can just go ahead and finish this part off. And let's come back right here. And we're going to use this as our line, as our guide. So come out about right here. And I'm going to draw one strand. Comes curves. And curves right back up. There. And then on this side, we're going to do the same thing right here with some zigzags. So one, two, and bring it up. And then in this one right here, tuck it right back in. And you can even add a strand that comes through right there and in. So hopefully I made that easy for you to follow. I know there's kind of complicated, right? There's all these strands, but we're just trying to build his hair. Okay, so there. And then one more strand right here at the top. It kind of pops out and in. And tuck in another strand right there just to finish it off. Okay, finally we're done with his hair right here. Oh, but actually, you know what? <laughs> I forgot, there's actually some strands right here on the side, in the bottom right here. So let's come right underneath his ear, draw a curve, and another curve, just to finish it off. Same thing here. Curve, and another one. Okay, now we're really done with his hair. Let's start his body. And we're going to come right in the center and I'm going to draw his neck. So right here, curve and a curve. And we're going to bring this down so we can draw his collar, bring it down and let's go up. We're just going to curve up to create his collar. And then we're going to come, so his neck, so his shoulder's going to come out about right here and down. So then using this, we're going to add a curve right here for her shirt. And then with this tip, we're going to bring down a curve. So then let's imagine his shoulders are right here. So I'm just going to say his arm hits about right there on both sides, right underneath. But right there, I'm going to use this to draw a slight angle line. There. Okay, so then using this line, I'm going to come up right here to finish off his jacket that he's wearing, his little top. And let's bring this down on both sides. So we're just going to keep bringing this down. About right there. Let's see. Let's come back to his sleeves so I can figure out how long to bring this. So I'm just going to bring down his sleeves right here. About right there. I'm going to cut it off for his cuff on his sleeve. And same thing on this side. Okay, so sleeves about right there. Bring this down a little bit more. But right there, I'm going to cut it off. So bring this one lower. And then about right here, I'm going to connect it with a curve on both sides. There. 
Okay, so then we're going to come in here. I'm going to give a little circle before I forget on this cuff. And then now we can go ahead and cut it off. So about right here, I'm going to draw a line that go across, goes across, and then his belt. So another loop, another curve. Just come in here with two lines for a buckle. And then from the center of this, let's come about right here. A slight angle line. And we're going to draw his legs from this point in the center. And right here, we're going to start to bring his legs down. Okay, so then from there, let's keep bringing this down. Really long, thin legs, right? So I'm just going to keep bringing this down. I'm going to work on this side first. So about there. I'm going to wiggle a little bit on the bottom for his jeans and about right there. I'm going to cut it off and come in here with some details for jeans. And let's do the same thing over here. So as you come to the bottom, wiggle a little bit for the crease at the bottom. And cut it off. And then his shoes. So it's come out right here. And this is going to be straight. And we're just going to go ahead and connect it. Same thing over here. So straight, and this part comes out. Angle and connect it. So I'm going to add some details. So come give him a bottom right here. Then a top right here. Curve, another curve, and then two curves inside for laces. So same thing right here. I'm going too fast, please pause the video. And two curves right there for his shoes. Okay, so then finally, let's draw his arms. So I'm just having them behind his back, make it simpler. <laughs> so right here, angle and then angle. So his arms are gonna come out, angle, and then just curve it in. Same thing here. Curve in, and then angle in, right in the back. So then for some details on his pants, let's come right in the center, add a center line, some pockets, and his shirt right here in the center, he has these stripes of color. And you can add a pocket. I think he has a pocket on both sides, right? I hope I'm not wrong, but I believe he does. Oh, and I also forgot <laughs> there's buttons right here on this side. So I'm just going to randomly add maybe four buttons on one side. And that is pretty much it. <laughs> My version of Adrian from Miraculous Ladybug. Hope I made it easy for you to follow along and it inspires you to draw it too. Thanks so much for watching and if you loved it, please make sure to subscribe so you won't miss any new Drastic Cute videos. See you later.